Hello everybody and welcome to this Utalk tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to save images from your computer and uh, transfer them onto an SD card and uh, and then transferring, inserting the SD card into your tablet and then from the tablet saving it on to your uh, tablet so you can use those pictures um, in the grid or any other place you'd want to. So first off I'm going to go ahead and create a folder on my desktop. Um, I'm just going to simply right click and I'll have an, uh, a pop-up menu that comes up and I'm going to click on uh, new over here and then click on folder just going to name the folder for this example um, Boston and uh, as you can see I've named the tablet or sorry named the folder excuse me Boston and I'm just going to click enter so that folder is uh, all set and created now let's go and get some images that we want to save so go ahead and launch the the browser of your of your choice. I'm going to use Google Chrome for this one and let's just go on images.google.com and click enter. So here we are on Google Images and now let's just search for you know say Boston sports logos uh, in the PNG format. Uh, you don't need to enter PNG but I just did because I like the images in PNG format. So here's a, a few uh, images that we get over here. Let's just um, you know tell you what to do. So click on the image that you want and another pop-up will come up. Now you want to right click over here and you'll get another menu and you want to click save image as. This is very important, save image as. When you click it you will get another pop-up um, that will give you the option to, um, you know, signet the what destination you want to save the folder in. So right now I'm going to click on desktop because that's where I created my folder, and then find my Boston folder, which you can see right here. Double click, and uh, just save, uh, save the pictures. So let's go ahead and save a couple more pictures. Uh, let's save this BC logo over here. Right click, you know, save image as, and in our Boston folder, as you can see. Boston folder, there's our previously saved image, and click save. Let's go ahead and save this cool logo with everything. Uh, right click, save image as, and save. And last one, let's take the Celtics logo. And right click on it, save image as, and we'll just click save again. So we saved four total images. Now if you go back into your desktop, you'll see the Boston folder there again. You can double click it and you know make sure that the image is saved. And there you have it, those are our four images. Now once we're satisfied, we've created our folder, saved our images. Let's go ahead and take the um, take a, an SD card and insert it into um, the appropriate spot on the laptop. Um, right now for myself, I have uh, this card reader with a micro SD card inside here or you can use um, a USB adapter like this um, it doesn't make a difference which one you use but in this one the card goes down the little slot over here and for this reader the card goes right into here you can see the card right there I'm gonna click it in so let's go back to our laptop and we're gonna insert the card we have into um, the slot, let me just find, okay, there it is. And it's in there. So depending on what you named um, your card, or um, it'll, it should come up for this example, um, you'll see you know, a pop-up coming that there's a card inserted. Um, it, our, our card's name is 4GB SD card, so we can either click open folder from here, and you know, it'll show us what's inside the, the, the card already, um, because this is a brand new brand new card, there's nothing inside there except for that one little folder. If that pop-up doesn't come, you can simply click on, you know, start and go to uh, computer. Or if you have a My Computer logo on your desktop, click there and you'll see your hard drive, first of all. And then you'll see on the side here all other um, drives present and you can see this SD card. So we'll go into it and double click and there's our drive again. Now, what you want to do is go back to your desktop and go to the folder you created. For example, in our case, this was the Boston folder. We're gonna click on the folder, we're gonna right click on it, 
when you right click there'll be a menu that pops up with various options there's open you know do other things blah 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 and you'll find the send to over here you want to take your mouse and hover over the send to for a second and you'll get some more options and here you'll find your SD card right here 4GB SD card so if you click here that folder should now have gone and been copied to um, uh, the SD card so we're gonna click on um, start once again we're gonna go to computer and we're gonna go on our SD card over here and as you can see boom the Boston folder is right there so what we did was we originally clicked we saved the images from the computer we created a new folder when our Google images saved the images into this Boston folder or any other folder you create um, once we were satisfied um, we inserted the SD card into the, the computer either by using a card reader or by using a USB adapter we right clicked on the folder went to send to and then found the name of our SD card and sent it and the folder has been copied to our SD card so now you can go ahead and uh, eject the card. I'm gonna eject the card right here and take it out. You want to take out the micro SD and this is what the micro SD looks like, quite a small card. And now our job with the laptop is done and we're gonna move on to our tablet real quick. So here I have my tablet and as you can see, sorry, it's a little blurry, you just need to focus it in. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and for the transformers, this the slot for inserting the the SD card is on the side over here. So we're just gonna take our card and insert that right in there. Sorry, it's actually on the bottom over here. So you'll notice a slot right here, and that allows the card to go in. Uh, once you find this spot, it's on the right side of the tablet. You want to click and click it and push that in. You'll hear a click, and that should be set. So now, if we open, you should see a little message over here, preparing, um, or you know something similar to that. So you know the card is actually being. Uh, red inside. So let's go ahead and unlock our tablet. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, preparing external storage is the message that comes. You'll see it on the bottom. So we'll unlock our tablet. Now we do need to download one application from the Google Play Store. Um, it's a file browser. Um, you only need to do this once um, and then the process is pretty simple after that. So you click on Google Play. We're going to search for a file manager. file manager and you will notice a bunch of things come up you want to download the second one which is file manager HD and in brackets you'll see tablet for rhythm software so you're gonna click in and click install and accept and download and um, it's downloading right now and you know a couple megabytes and installing and it's all set so we're gonna exit by clicking the the home button over here and um, either an icon should appear over here or you can access it by going and populating your applications and going to file manager so let's go ahead and click on that here's what it look, lo looks like it might look a little bit confusing but you only need to worry about a couple things um, you're gonna look on the left side and you're gonna see a few tabs available uh, storage system gallery download music blah 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 you're gonna click on storage because we want to uh, go into our, the contents of our SD card that we inserted and as you can see you'll see a Boston folder right there that we had copied from our computer now what you want to do is pretty simple you want to take the folder you want to copy you want to put your finger on it and hold it for a couple of seconds and there'll be a uh, menu that pops up you want to there's a details open copy delete move rename you want to click on copy and now you want to go back and look on the left side again and you'll see the gallery uh, tab you want to go ahead and click gallery and now you're, you'll see a bunch of folders there um, I'm just gonna delete this one that I had before sorry about that and um, and all you want to do is now you just want to click on paste there's a paste button above um, which you can see or not see but it's it's the first button on the top bar next to the house which is the home so when you click on paste 
you know, your Boston folder is now copied. So there it is. So that's all you have to do to uh, copy the folder on your, on your SD card to the tablet. And once it's all set, you can exit. And, you know, let's try to load up one of the images we saved from the computer onto our grid. So let's go ahead and launch Utalk. And uh, we'll go into uh, edit mode. And let's select this first tile on the top here. We're going to click here and, you know, pull a picture from the gallery. And um, if you notice, uh, there is our Boston folder. Um, actually, one other step you uh, might want to do before is just simply eject your SD card because now the gallery is going to show you double, uh, double folders because it's going to pull from all images uh, that are available on the tablet. So just find the card on the, on the right-hand side and simply just click and pull it out. Here's our SD card. And now you want to go back into the gallery. And, and you'll see um, our Boston folder right there and we'll click into it and there's our four logos we saved the BC logo and some few other ones we'll pull this nice Bruins logo and type in you know Boston and click confirm and there you have it the process is fairly simple uh, it seems long on the video because there's just a few initial things you need to do you just have to make sure that you've downloaded this file manager HD application from the Google Play Store and also, um, you know, the pro on your laptop, just make sure you know how to create the folder, new folder, and, you know, saving images to it from your website, right-clicking, send to, send it, insert your SD card into the uh, laptop or desktop, and um, send that to there, and then connect the SD card to the tablet, and, um, and then, you know, follow the, follow the steps in the file manager, you know, launch it, you want to click on storage, which is the first tab, you know, um, and your folders will pop up. You want to hold it for a couple seconds, click on copy, and then go to the gallery, which is the third tab over here, and simply click, click, click paste, which is next to the home. So following that, your picture should be copied. Be sure to eject your card from the tablet, and you should be good to go.